Gary, thanks. We're starting with some breaking news out of South Bend, where after four and a half years, charges are now filed in the murder of a teenager. WSBT 22 Zach Crenshaw is now live at Metro Homicide and brings us these brand new details about the death of Bernard Vaughn back in the summer of 2010. Zach. Bob, this has been a long investigation for law enforcement, but they say they finally identified the man they say is responsible for the death of Bernard Vaughn back in 2010. 23-year-old Deontay Jarrell Calhoun is being charged with murder, and police need your help in locating him. A warrant is now out for his arrest, and police say he should be considered armed and dangerous. Calhoun, who also goes by D. Calhoun, has family in both Chicago and South Bend. He hasn't been seen in South Bend since this summer, though, so police think he's in Chicago. Now, the crime took place back in 2010 in the 1000 block of Mayflower Road. Metro homicide commander Tim Corbett called the murder an assassination, plain and simple. In the probable cause documents, it says D. Calhoun told an associate he was going to rob Bernard, and when he did, he shot Vaughn multiple times in the back of the head while he was eating. Police say this case was particularly difficult because the victim, Bernard Vaughn, had just testified in a murder trial the week before, and police suspected the crime was retaliation. This was a case that was extremely convoluted, only because there were so many people involved and so many different theories uh, as to who would have done it and why, and what reasoning was there. Um, so those leads all had to be tracked down, and we had to make sure that we had the right information to charge the right people. Now, one, now, once again, Deontay Calhoun is the only person being charged with murder. Police say there wasn't necessarily one big break in this case, but through a series of interviews in multiple states, particularly with members of, a, of the Cash Out gang that used to be in South Bend, they were able to talk with witnesses who say that uh, Calhoun told them he murdered Vaughn. So uh, this is particularly satisfying for Metro Homicide. They say it's a big win. And they say they're particularly uh, happy because they're able to bring some closure after all these years uh, to the murder of, Bern or to the mother of Bernard Vaughn. In South Bend, Zach Crenshaw, WSBT 22 News. Okay, very much, uh, Zach, appreciate it. Thanks very much, and I know you'll have the very latest coming up with WSBT 22 first at four. Police are investigating.